Hey folks, DC7 here. Welcome back to the channel, and welcome back to Evorian, a forex space game that you uh, get to create your own ships and fly through a very, very, very large galaxy, uh, trading, exploring, fighting pirates, smuggling, doing all kinds of things. So the first time... Do you mind, kitties? I'm doing something here. The uh, first time we had a look, we had a little bit of a look at the tutorial to see how it measured up, and it did a pretty good job of getting a person... <laughs> I'm sorry, Dexter is just such a clown. Uh, getting a person used to how to play the game and the mechanics of it, which are fairly intuitive and really well done, might I add. Um, second time we had a little bit of a look at combat. So where am I currently? Well, I have actually restarted. I put a few hours into the game to learn a little more about it, and I'm quite impressed. It is, in fact, a very complicated little animal, as far as the depth to it and what's going on, what you can do. Um, you can build bases, uh, like stations, I guess that would be a better term. You can build your own stations. You can have fleets of ships. You can, once you've been at it for a while, you can... <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't know what's up with these two today. You can actually scroll out till you've got a galaxy map and almost turn this into an RTS. You know, moving ships about here, there, and everywhere. And Yeah. It's uh, really quite interesting, but I thought what we do here is, uh, you can see I'm in my little drone ship, my mining drone, the little thing you start with, and all I've done to this point is gathered ores. I have some 17,000 iron, uh, some 1,700 <laughs> titanium, and I have 64,000 credits. Um, because one thing you can also do, and I didn't get a chance to show you during the uh, tutorial or the combat one, just because I couldn't find one, is you will occasionally see these huge asteroids in these fields where you've got hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of asteroids. Um, they're not only big, but most of the asteroids here have a sort of basically round or basically rectangular or you know what I mean they're kind of a single shape the then they're gonna find these huge huge asteroids that are kinda like a bunch of potatoes glued together like they're just kind of a deformed looking thing you can claim them when you come within the point zero whatever it is kilometers of them and then sell them to the highest bidder. You not only get a ton of money, in this case I got like 60 something thousand dollars, you also get a bunch of rep with that particular, <laughs> sorry, with that particular faction, or race I guess they would be actually, as these are all different species of aliens. I'm currently heading towards the shipyard because I'm feeling like I've maybe got, uh, enough materials on me to get a small ship going. I, uh, my last uh, playthrough, well not playthrough, but where I was actually having a, a, a deeper look at the game and messing about with some of the mechanics with it, I bought a ship at the shipyard and I had a couple of hundred thousand credits at that point and just I think 40,000 iron and 15,000 titanium. And, I mean, I was still only at that sector. I was only still on my first two metals. But um, <laughs> I bought a ship at the shipyard, and I thought, well, I'd like to put lots of those modules in it because I want to be able to, you know, take on pirates and mine things and yada yada. It turned out um, I needed a crew of, like, 50-something people to man this thing. Uh, yeah, I kid you not. It needed, I think, nine miners. It needed 16 gunners. It needed 12 mechanics. It needed four sergeants. And because there was four, it required also a lieutenant. Because when you get over a certain number of crew members, you have to start hiring sergeants to look after them. 
and when you get a certain number of sergeants you have to hire lieutenants to look after them well I'm in a ship that doesn't have enough people to run it so it won't go fast it won't repair itself and unfortunately there's a shortage of crew in the particular system I'm in so that coupled with the fact that I thought well I might actually know enough about this game now to make it interesting for you guys to watch I think I'm gonna start a let's play so that's sort of where we are now and I've actually managed to uh, keep harping on long enough to actually get to the station I wanted to be at so lovely we're even on I think for the first time since I played this game the uh, proper approach trail there we go so we'll just bring her in I'm hoping there's a dock on this side You are speaking. All right, build ship, repair docks, sell goods, uses reconstruction. What do we got here? Resource, 100 steel. Well, that's nice. <laughs> I don't have any uh, cargo on this thing. But what we're looking to do, actually, is um, just simply park up here for the moment. Yeah, I don't have any goods to sell. I've got lots of materials, but I'd like to use them. And the build ship... That was the cats actually jumped across my computer desk in their hurry to chase each other about. Um, this build ship option will actually bring up this menu. And this allows you to, well, oddly enough, build a ship. <laughs> but, as I said, this is where I simply move the scale up. And as you move the scale up, of course, the ship is going to change. Here's your, or this scaling is block size and volume. I can grab that there you go now you can see that we've actually got a huge huge ship right 298,000 iron to build that okay there's the same thing in a tiny scale right and you've got a bunch of different stuff there's a bunch of different styled ships and these are based on the different factions because each faction although every ship is unique they do have a certain style to them so but there's the build thing and it will build some pretty amazing things there's your cost there's what it's going to take in iron and titanium you can buy insurance for it while you're here you can get a crew and captain um, all of those things right out of the shipyard however what we're in fact going to do is uh, put a little bit of free space in here just a little bit that should do it and we're gonna actually build ourselves a ship oh um, of course we have to found a ship first all right so this is gonna be our new ship the Explorer cuz such a great name <laughs> Okay, here we go. Now, let's Zumba Fumba. Are we not? Oh, we need to now go into build mode. There we go. All right. This is the beginning. Okay. So, first thing I want to put onto this puppy is some crew quarters. There we go. And these can be iron. That's quite fine. <laughs> nope. Yep. Boom. There's some cruise quarters. And that is going to require uh, oh, just the angle here. Let's see. All right, that'll give me room for 18 crew. It requires one mechanic. Okay, T 
to keep this much ship up to puff. So, now what I want to do is actually go to our titanium and we're going to want a titanium energy container we're going to want a titanium generator and an integrity field generator oops I also need the gyro array uh, and inertial dampeners back on the bar so crew quarters we're good on for the moment and gyro array uh, we'll replace with that and I want solar panels but do I want these okay yeah there we are all right now what I want next is that Okay, what's our current? What do we got here? Pitch yaw, blah blah blah, hull shields. Where is the uh generated energy? Currently 0.5 gigawatt. Required energy 74 megawatts. Storable energy 20 gigajoule. If we add this, still I don't think we want it quite that big. Um, yeah, whoops. Let's go a little smaller. Okay. Yeah, it's much better. Now we can store 28.5. And so that we can actually produce that much, we are going to add generators. All right. Now, we are going to generate with that 2.15. So you can see we've uh, well exceeding the 74 that we require. The other thing I want is an integrity field generator. This, we're going to plug right here. There we go. And that's basically like a shield. Okay. All right, now... What I want to do is come out a little ways here. We can now go into, how are we doing? Woohoo, yeah. Engines. Oh, whoopsie. <laughs> okay. I didn't realize that. I'm a uh, little off center here. Um, okay, we'll get the materials back for these. I wonder, can you actually? Uh, no, you can't. Oh, move mirror to selection. Focus. Nope. Looks like I just got to pop it out of there. Okay. Let's go back to our integrity. And this time, let's plug it dead center. There we go. All right. Now, let's go to our engines. Okay. That should probably do. Now we need to... Thrusters. Oh, one thing that's very important and I don't want to forget is this. There we go. That'll allow us pitch and roll. Okay. And under here, there we are. We're going to allow our inertial dampeners. That'll help slow us down when we're going like all crazy. 
Okay, let's get some thrusters on here. Or some, yeah. Go about halfway. Same on this side. And... Titanium solar panels. Okay, but I don't... Actually... want them to look like that. Nope. Yep. There we go. And I want it to be... That's about right. Boom. Cool. That'll add. And... <coughs> front here. How close are we in size there? That shadow is a little deceiving. And, oopsie. There we go. A little bit of directional thruster there. Alright, what don't we have? Well, we're good on the ship. And the thrust isn't the best, eh? What do we got left? Titanium to add anymore. Okay, that's all right. Our thrust is now pretty good. Forty-four point nine. Nah, it's not brilliant, but it's pretty good. So, um, okay, we want to go select some blocks here. Um, okay. That uh, won't let us merge them? Hmm. Alright, I guess I shouldn't really be too surprised. But I think we have... Alright. Pretty much everything we require for the moment, other than, again, some crew. Um, beyond that, we should be pretty good. Okay. Alright, reasonably, reasonably, okay, let's come in a little closer here. Stops nice and quick, wow. Okay, uh, oh, before I do that actually. There is one thing I have forgotten, and that is, let's go back into build mode for a moment, and let's go into our inventory, shall we? So, shippy, and I don't think I have anything to put into the systems. Ooh, look at that, we've got one, two, three available system slots already. Nice. Uh, cargo, nope, that's not what I want. Uh, bum, 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 bum. Oh, what am I doing? I'm sorry. Here, let's actually go into the inventory. And we've got one chain gun turret. And we've got one double iron mining turret. Okay. So, the... Uh, sure. Let's put you... Where'd you go? What the heck? Where did you go, man? Chain gun turret, okay. Double iron mining turret. Get back there. Don't be doing these things to me. Okay. 
Okay. And we'll put our little chain gun turret down here for the heck of it. Okay. We're, uh, I suppose I could have moved them forward a little bit, but I think we're all right. Okay, now that that is that, let's uh, get ourselves some crew. Hopefully, hire a crew, see what they've got. All right, let's take this guy, move it over here, go into our ship, and come up with the crew roster. And this will tell us what we actually need. So, we need engineers. Let's have a look here. What do we got? They've got 11. We need four. Higher. Okay. Um, okay, did it not allow... You, what? Oh, I'm not docked. <laughs> it's going, you must be docked. I'm sorry. Where's my docks? Uh, why don't they see? Oh, there's a dock. I guess my mining ship is the one that's uh, at the dock. <laughs> wow, does this thing ever slow down quick? That's crazy. Look, boom. Not that we're going all that fast, I gotta admit. <laughs> Okay. There we are. Now we're docked. Let's hire some crew. Alright. So, we know that we need four of these guys. Let's hire them. Oh, I want my, uh, me other window up, man. <coughs> Excuse me. Hire. Alright. And as you can see, it immediately placed them. Uh, because, again, because these guys, they're worth 1.5 each. All right, so we've actually got 130% of what we require for performance. All right, we have the right number of the dudes, that ain't it. Okay, now we need miners. Four miners. Woohoo, they have them. I love it. So, that's two, three, four. We'll hire them. Boom! Professional miners. Nice. We also need some mechanics. And they suggest four. Well, they've got enough. Let's do it. Come on. There we are. Heart. Now, see, I've just run into this issue. It tells me I need sergeants. Okay. Um... <laughs> Yeah, that's not good. Not good. Um, hmm. See, now I've got to go somewhere else and hope that they have sergeants, not to mention mechanics. And in fact, what I'm going to have to do here is go away from that. Crewman, okay. Okay, and I'm going to have to dismiss one of these. Now, I should be able to hire, at least at this point, a couple of mechanics. Oh, that's engineers. Here we are, mechanics. Because I do believe this is based on how many crew you have. There we go. Now, let's auto-assign everything. Yeah. Now we're a lot closer. I want these guys on board because it is going to ensure... Um, that the ship repairs itself as we travel. All right. Uh, what we're after now, though, we've got to find a sergeant. And as you can see, they unfortunately don't have any here. So, uh, bump, 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 bump. Where would I maybe find one? Is there a repair place? Uh, probably, eh? Hmm, I don't see one. I thought there was one. Oh, there it is. It's over there. Okay. Repair dock. 
<clears throat> oh, that's something else that I should do while we're at it, is uh, go back to my ship. Go here. Oh, apparently I've got two double iron mining turrets. That's a little odd. Hmm, okay. <laughs> I have to check this out. Because, yeah. Alright, let's go back to build mode for a moment. Oh, I do indeed, don't I? Okay. Let's zoom in here. Clickety click. And let's remove a voo. Poof. And let's take you and put you. Alright, what's going on here? There we go. Oh, apparently I can have two of them on there. I actually have the mass for it. So can I run two mining lasers as well? Maybe I can. Maybe I can. Ah, uh, okay. So I can go one way or the other, eh? You know what? I think I'm actually going to go. this way because you really need to do a bunch of mining at this point if they'll allow me to put a second at all there we go cool all right let's uh, get back out of buildo modo and go and see uh, where were we off to ah uh, yes there all right, how about if I hit the big guys? Oh, I need to uh, now go into here. And let's uh, also put you on one. And we'll put you on two. All right. Excellent. Now, we don't actually have the gunners that we require. So that's something to keep in mind, too. And that'll be crew that we will be looking for. Now, let's see how we do here. Wow, very quickly we get up to the top. And now it's starting to kill our batteries, so let's back off. And I don't want two to be activated at the moment, thanks. Just, you know, so we don't accidentally spray somebody we might like. Let's go back. Ooh, they haven't recharged the battery yet, my mistake. There we go. It is a long way between these. And not having enough crew means we're... Uh-oh, uh I hope they're not uh, enemies. I do, I do, I do. Uh, nope, they're purple. So they're basically neutral to us. I can see a bunch of purple squares in the bottom. It's on the other side. Okay, it's dark. And hope that they have crew. Oh, yes, look, sergeants. Excellent, excellent. Okay, what do you use? Security, I'm not that concerned about. But we need. Uh, yeah, they're not cheap. But you know what? I'm going to hire two of them. Okay. And then the rest of this is basically we don't have a lot of use for. So I have to go elsewhere and see if I can find some more uh, folk that I need. 
And oddly enough, where we were was actually the best spot. Sad as that is. So, because it's a long way. Uh oh. The aliens, they are attacking. We don't have gunners, and there was none available there. So, uh, we don't want to get involved. Generally, what I did in the last one, anyways, whenever I saw something like this, um, well, no. If, if pirates come in, then wait until they engage other ships. Like, if you're still in a position like this, where you've got, you know, one or two guns usable, and they're only going to do seven or eight or nine damage, um, wait till they're engaging other ships and then just sort of hang in the background and get as many shots in as you can it'll not only count but you'll get to pick up some of the loot and the loot will be things like modules um, good weapons stuff like that so this is hardly fair because there's like four of them picking on that one dude unfortunately I don't have a gunner so I'm not even going to be of any value to them at all so I think what we'll do is try and get a little bit past this whole scenario. All right, there's our battery starting to drain, but we gained some pretty good ground. And we'll back off. It'll continue to drain probably down to almost zero before they start to recharge, because you'll notice my usage bar doesn't immediately drop. And there we go. Now it's dropping and it will start to recharge. Of course, I'm still doing almost 500 meters per second. All right, I've got lots of thrust on this. I don't like being slowed down. <laughs> okay, now they are recharging our batteries. But you'll see we're not, we're not gaining on the old uh, hull integrity. We are still very slowly losing over time because I don't have enough mechanics on board. Ooh. And I'm not that fond of the side of the ship we're particularly picking up on here. There we go. There's a dock down here. That's nice. Alright. Let's dock. Whew. Let's hire some crew. Okay. Now we definitely need this up. Yep. Yeah. Alrighty. So we need gunners. Gunners they have. We require at least two at this point. However, um, what do they have? They have three. What, they have one? Oh, they have nine. What the heck? Oh, I don't want nine. Two, four. Higher. Okay. Now... We also require, uh, what else? Ah, mechanics. Mechanics. I'm going to hire two more mechanics. There we go. I think everything at this point is pretty much handled. We have five. That's an engineer, right? Get our other engineer back. <coughs> Miners, uh, how many have you got? Four, eh? We'll hire another two. Okay. Because I plan on adding more guns. <laughs> to be honest with you, that's what's going on there. And that's why I'm hiring these extra dudes. Because I think very quickly here, I will be able to do that. All right. So, we now, oh, what is it telling me? Why do I not, it says I still don't have enough crew. Overpopulated, oh, build more quarters, okay, thank you. And you can see we've also now got pirates attacking this section. So, first thing I need to do though is go to build mode and go to crew quarters. We can build some iron crew quarters. Uh, titanium, I don't have any iron. Oh, that's cargo. <laughs> Hull crew quarters, there we go. All right. 
right, let's uh, take that. There we go. We're now good. And we should be able to uh, select this and this and merge them. Why can we not do that? Oh, they're not touching. Ugh. Hmm. Oh, well. That's um, really unfortunate. Select blocks. Okay, now they won't unselect. Let me come out of build for a moment. All right. Now. Got to delete that for a moment. And let's actually... There we are. Now it's touching. Okay. So we should be able to and merge. Still won't do it. Hmm. No? Hmm. Oh well, it's beyond me, but as you can see, we now have 19 of 28. So we are fully functional now. We're an actual working thing. And, oh no, we still get pirates. So at this point, we could if we wanted to, and we do. Um, we're going to deactivate one, we're going to activate two. Now we've got next to nothing for firepower. But like I said, it's worth getting in on this. And I don't want to ride with no battery, but I'm going to get a bit of a boost here. There we go. So. Nope, missed him. There we go. Nope, missed him. Oh, that's wreckage, so I take it they've already got him. So let's head for this bandit. <coughs> now, I have no doubt this gun is pretty much garbage. Um, oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. There we go. Now I'm helping. See me helping? Oh, this one doesn't have an overheat. That's convenient. It means I can just jam the trigger down and go nuts. See, he's not even paying any attention to me. There we go. And there's the magic. A, a green weapon? A card of some kind? What's that? Oh. Apparently. There we go. Awesome. Oh. A little bit of materials here. Anything else? Not really. Oh, oh, oh. What do we got there? Boom. Okay. Let's see what we picked up, shall we? Nice. Uh, a shield booster. A basic trading displays prices of goods. Hmm, interesting. But we also managed to get ourselves a double iron mining turret. And now we've got an iron mining turret. Chain gun turret, iron mining turret. Okay. We've got three of these now. Hmm. Independent targeting, that means they'll basically uh, automatically start mining when you get near things. Uh, apparently we took a little bit of damage. Why are we not repairing? We do have mechanics. Or are we just very slowly? Hmm.
Oh, that's a cargo hauler. There's the repair dock. Let's head over there and see how it's going. But that was a, uh, a good start. It doesn't hurt to get in there and hep out with the old pirate thing whenever you can. You know, hopefully from a, a far enough distance that you're not, uh, like I said, becoming the target of their attention. Yeah, there's a lot of wreckage floating around. You can actually salvage that. There are turrets that allow salvaging other things besides just metals. I don't think we actually got any of that. Uh, mining, mining, and mining. Nope, not that time. But we will. And I think, at this point... Um, yeah, okay, that one, that last green dot's brighter. They are repairing, it just takes a heck of a long time. What we want to ideally do here is, uh... Oh, apparently, uh... Hmm. Plastic nanobots and fuel are what these guys sell. Yeah, you see the next square is starting to light up green on my hull integrity. So the the mechanics are doing their job. It's just we're sort of down a little further than we really should be. So let's uh, hurry this along a little. There we go. And let's look for a dock. There we go. Oh, there's one here as well. So. Looks like it is probably on the other side of the vessel. Oh, well, maybe not. Yep, it is. Of course it is. There we are. Paradox. All right, we don't have enough titanium, but we've got enough iron. Okay. Oh, so it won't repair any of it. Oh. Well, looks like we got to go hunt some titanium, or as I said, if we wait, it will actually, you know heal itself as it were because we do have our mechanics but i think that's going to do it for this episode guys um hope you enjoyed we uh, we have a not bad ship going on here seems to go pretty good stops pretty good it's generating enough energy that we don't get into too much trouble so now we got to hope we find some modules that will allow us to do things like add extra turrets etc etc hope you enjoyed if you did please hit the like button let me know down in the comments what you'd like to see Till next time, though, this has been Species 7. Have another look at Avorian. Take care of each other, folks, and ciao for now.